You can show someone a better way to do something, but they won't adopt your approach until they trust you. Never is this more true than when trying to lead peers. Colleagues may resent, even fear, assistance from a peer. Peer-to-peer -peer leadership is seldom easy, but not impossible. Leading colleagues rests upon two principles, understanding need and delivering value. You must understand the situation a peer is facing, and you have to have the skills to help him or her succeed. And so it's important to consider what the need is and what value you can offer. Let's define our terms further. There are many ways to define need. Sometimes need manifests itself as a problem. That is, a colleague is struggling and can't seem to find a solution. If the peer can help alleviate the situation, he's helpful. If you can diagnose a root cause of the problem and solve it, you are worth following. Value must be based on competency. That is, what you do well. For example, if you're in finance, your financial acumen can be of assistance with folks and operations. And conversely, an operations person can help a finance person understand how the business truly works. For a leader, however, value is more than competency. It is influence, how you can help the individual get things done. Such influence is based upon an understanding of people, their wants, needs, and aspirations. When you deliver for others, they begin to trust you and become receptive to what you have to offer. Leaders who understand the need and can satisfy it with their value are those that peers welcome because they know that such a leader is someone who can help them do their jobs better.